Welcome back friends, welcome to another video from Shomu's Biology. In this video, I am going to tell you about the confusion regarding the percentile calculation and percentage values in CSI NET results. Every single time uh, after the NTA conduct the examination for CSI UGC NET, people always get confused with their marks and uh, when they ask like what is percentile, what is percentage, what we mean by percentile, what percentage is the cutoff and many more questions. So all your queries will be cleared in this video. So the very first thing that you need to understand is the fundamental difference between percentage and percentile. Now the difference is that the percentage is an absolute value uh, but percentile is a relative value. Percentage is the value calculated based on the marks that you got out of 100. So if you get 60 out of 100, your percentage is 60%. You get 80 out of 100, your percentage is 80%. Now as per CSR UGC NET's life science division, the cutoff generally is present for 60% maximum, I can say, for general unreserved category GRF and 54% to 55% for general unreserved category LS. Now anything beyond that number you secure a good mark and you get to know you get to qualify the examination. But last time CSIR has not declared the cutoff in percentage for life science only. Guess why? Too much, too much flaw in their system. Whatever mistakes they do, they will pretend the mistakes are done by the students and not by them. I hate CSIR for that. And CSIR declared life science result with percentile value only if you check the score for all the other subjects it's it was always mentioned in percentage but for life science it's only mentioned in percentile why so why so much ambiguity so that's a separate uh, process but now let me tell you the idea about percentile if they declare the marks if they declare their result their cutoff in percentile what does that mean it means if somebody gets 80 percentile that means that person is better then 80% of the population or uh, of the individual that are present there. That means if somebody gets uh, 70, that means you are better than 70% uh, of the whole population where you are uh, attending the exam for. If the total number of students are 100 in that case. So here, if you get 98 percentile, that means you are better than 98% of the individual that attended that exam. Okay, that's very simple calculation uh, that you can take. So for CSI net life science examination last time the unreserved general category for GRF was provided to be 98 point something okay I'll share uh, the details in a separate video you can check that one out too regarding the expected cutoff of CSI net examination so here is 98 point something percentile 98.20 percentile for example so anyone with more than 98.20 percentile is qualified for uh, the GRF general or unreserved category on the other hand, if somebody gets 70, then that means that individual is uh, only getting 70 percentile, which is not good. So 60 percentage is a good value, but 85, 90, 92, 94 percentile is not good because percentile calculation is comparison between you, how much you got and how much the whole other population uh, got. For example, in an examination, let's say there are 100 students and among 100 let's say uh, the highest score was 70 only okay and you got 70 out of 100 so what is your percentage 70 percent but as you got the highest score your percentile will be 100 got it so somebody got 20 as a least score so least score in that examination is 20 so the percentage for that person is 20 percent but as that person got the least score the percentile for that person will be zero Okay, so person with 20 marks gets 0th percentile, the person with 70 marks got 100th percentile based on the percentile calculation. That is something that you need to look for. So, do not assume that if you get more than 90, 92, 93, 94, 95 percentile, you are qualifying. No, to get a good score, it should be more than 98 percentile. Mark my word, more than 98 percentile, less than that. For unreserved category in CSI and life science, you will never qualify the examination for GRF. Thomas Biology's Diwali sale is going on and here what you can do, you can enroll yourself for the upcoming CSI net batch which is going to be uh, starting from February. But from now on if you can join Shomu's Biology you need to pay less that is 5200 rupees 
uh, of the total amount that is 15,200 you need to pay only 5,200 now and you can join our course and you'll be getting all the materials uh, time to time in your like hard copy books and you'll be also getting some of the lectures recorded versions completely throughout this time period of two to two and a half months where you can prepare your basics and bare basics will be clear throughout this time frame and then the the interactive class will begin from february onwards for the upcoming six months and the validity of the course will be two years so it's an action-packed powerful course that you can join and literally you're getting two and two and a half months extra of that course by paying only 5200 now and the rest 10000 uh, after two months i mean uh, by the time of 30th november so that offer is standing for the diwali offer if you want to avail that you can avail it the link is in the description and you can also call us the the number is given in this video as well as uh, the whatsapp number is there you can contact us through whatsapp email or website okay so that's the difference between percentile calculation percentage calculation and everything i believe this clears your doubt and now you can check your score. So if you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future. Thank you. Bye.